pallet with the weight and the vessel name. Then they cut, then they'll cut a piece off the tail. As you notice there on the end of the tail, there's a piece cut off. And also take a plug out of the swimmer fin, right behind the swimmer fin. That is to show the meat color from head to tail. For the most part, that's what that's what the tuna should look like. And then they place that above the above the pallet on the tuna. So during that time when they're unloading and putting on the putting on the pallets, all the people on the auction that are looking to bid on the fish can walk through and see the quality of that of that meat color. That would be something very important when they go to when they go to open the auction up. Because the price of that the price of that tuna is going to go by the texture, the quality, the firmness. Here we go. The first annual Roger Maya Pacific Seafood Hawaiian Tuna Cutting Event. Robert CEO, cut the head off, huh? Yeah. Yeah. What'd you do? Give her a gold knife? Yeah. There you go. Hey. This is not easy. Don't tell Ken that. Surprise how much meat is in that that head of that fish. Very delicate, very. When that tuna's on the auction block. Then they have bidders over there. Pacific Seafood, in partnership with Wajamaya, has a bidder on the block there that bids just for us. He goes along knowing the, knowing the quality that Wajamaya wants. He goes along, looks at the core. Uh, color. Yeah. Yeah.